Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Hope everyone's having a fantastic evening. Uh, so, I've taken some time to just kind of scour uh, eBay for some interesting coins that I've sold in the last week or two. And I actually found uh, a, a nice little grouping of odds and ends that you and I are going to talk about. And, um, of course, you're going to talk about it in the comments section. It's kind of a way of getting a conversation going. I know a lot of people have been sending me questions and inquiries and I just can't get to them. And uh, hopefully this will help spark a little bit of uh, uh, conversation amongst uh, uh, coins and what we find out there. This uh, 2016 Harper's Ferry Quarter, it's a Philadelphia minted quarter, uh, recently sold here in the last day or two for a nice little sum of ninety dollars and the the part that, that just kind of pops out at you at first is uh, that reverse how uh, worn down it is in comparison to the obverse which has George Washington on there which is nice and well struck and crisp and it's got lots of luster the uh, the two images that you have here of the front and back of the coin is exactly what was in the auction. It was not graded, and the reverse it's kind of questionable. And without further information, uh, this is one of those things that it's hard to justify paying even ninety dollars for. Uh, this could have where very well been a coin that was acid dipped at one point which would give it its uh, soft appearance on the reverse. If anything, this is more a, uh, a, uh, a, a test, if you will, uh, to come to, when it comes to your eBay prowess and being able to identify coins, especially, especially ones that are not graded or, um, have been certified of uh, you know uh, in some manner and being that there's two images and just looking at the images these you know they, these are pulled right off of that listing and they are they're not fantastic I didn't pay real much attention to see if there was a return policy but if you're spending $90 on a coin that's not authenticated I would certainly question if it was um, if it was available with a return policy uh, I, I would be more interested to see what the edge looks like now there is only one little piece to this whole puzzle that might make it a legitimate error and that's uh, if you looked on the, the obverse face where you have George Washington at the 10 o'clock position on the coin there's a little bit of a crack so this might very well be like a deteriorated die of some sort, um, uh, a very terminal uh, piece of die uh, or terminal die. You know, the thing was just you know on its last breath of life for crying out loud, and this is what you have. So let the conversation begin. I'd like to hear your opinion. Is this real? Is it fake? Is it worth the ninety dollars that it sold for? Me thinks it's kind of fifty-fifty. Uh, it's kind of hard to say, but in any event, I'd like to hear what you guys think. What you think about the whole eBay buying process, the selling process? I want to hear it all. I want to make sure that we clear the air uh, about the coins that we find, and uh, I look forward to hearing from each and every single one of you. Uh, let's all talk together. Uh, it's not just about me talking to you, but also some of the other YouTube followers uh, out there of uh, coin channels. I'd like to hear your comments as well to other members. Uh, you guys have a fantastic evening. I have more for you. Stay tuned. And thanks so much for watching.